Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to show you how to create this beautiful summer design. So, what we will need for this design is it's a base coat. Obviously, I can't find my base coat. Um, you need a dotting tool, a detailing brush or a striping brush, which one you prefer. Uh, some water, white and the black paint, and nail polish. So I will be using this gorgeous orange, pink, green, and blue, and the top coat as well. So I already applied the base coat on my nail. So what I'm gonna do now with some black paint. You're going to draw the design like this and you will just infill gaps with the nail polish. So, I'll take a striping brush. <laughs> Hope you can see it well. I prefer my detailing brush to be fair. When you do the long strokes, it's good to do it with the striping brush, but when you have like a small lines, you can do them with, with this. That's good. Then another line. It's a bit bigger nail than other one, so What we're gonna do now, we will just infill like this one. You can use your dotting tool or you can use your brush, but I find it easier to use dotting tool because if you're using like lighter, if you're using the brush with the nail polish, you have to soak nail polish your your uh, brush and nail polish remover which takes long time so I found it much easier to just just have it do it with dotting tool okay we'll just 
fill the gaps. Don't worry if you go on your nail polish on your black lines because you can do them anytime. It's just like a contour that you would see where you're doing it. So you have to worry if it's not right from the first time. Yeah, I'm still recording. Just check if I'm recording because last time I did 10 minutes video and I looked at it and I wasn't even recording it. <laughs> yeah, that was good. So now I'm always checking if I'm really recording videos. I don't want to do it again. Because you have to move all the time and start again. It's annoying. You, can't, you never can get the same. can put any color anywhere but the fountain colors look really nice together so that's why I chose them the bits of green From the nail polish proper dry, you can correct all of them black lines on the top of the nail polish so Why, but every time when I'm recording a video, my hands shake. <laughs> so scared. all there now so now we, what we have to do we have to wait for nail polish to dry and have a look where we need to redo the black black stripes again because when doing nail polish not until you can not always you can do the straight lines so it's easy thing just to do it again with the, the brush so that's how the finished design looks like 
This looks gorgeous, so summery. Well, it's not the warmest summer, but the nails have to look nice, even if not the best summer. Most of the nail polish is dry, so I will start from the places where it's already dried. Just to put the black in place, make it intense. You will have to wait for the black paints to proper dry because you will add some white dots to it. So it have to be all dry. Yeah, that looks lovely. That part should be a bit, bit thicker. There you go. All the designs done. Now we have to wait for black pines to dry and add some white dots. And that's it. And top coated, and all the design will be done. It's very simple, very easy to do. You can choose any colors you want, and it will look fantastic, to be fair. That's it. It's all done. Now what you have to do is you have to wait for paints to dry and top coat it and all the design will be done. The paint's not dried yet so I'm not top coating it. As you can see there's like a couple of dots I still have a bit of shiny when it's gone matte you, you have you are sure that like it's dried but while it's still a bit shiny don't mean they are still not proper dried so it is dry now so just All the design done. 
Hope you enjoyed this video and see you in your next one. Bye!